He may, but I do not. Note it. My friend's trust is not the issue today, Spartan Lock. It is my trust you must earn. Arbiter. You are a hunter, yes. A seeker of things. That's not the official job title, but it's close enough. And now you hunt other Spartans. I'm not so much hunting a Spartan as I'm hunting the Spartan. You seek. One, one, seven. I was not told the identity of your prey. That is why I'm sharing it with you now. We're talking about trust after all. May I ask you something? Your people used to call him demon. Was that an insult or a compliment? An insult to be sure, but one with a modicum of respect. He was indeed my enemy, but in time, I named him ally, even friend. The events which forged this bond were complete. set fire to their planet, but I followed with all the ships in my command. When you first saw Halo, were you blinded by its majesty? Blinded? Paralyzed? Dumbstruck? No. Yet the humans were able to evade your ships, land on the sacred ring, and desecrate it with their filthy footsteps. Noble hierarchs, surely you understand that once the parasite attacked... There will be order in this council! You were right to focus your attention on the flood. But this demon, this master chief... By the time I learned the demon's intent, there was nothing I could do. No more prophet of truth. This has gone on long enough. Make an example of this bungler. The council demands it. You are one of our most treasured instruments. Long have you led your fleet with honor and distinction, but your inability to safeguard Halo was a colossal failure. I will continue my campaign against the humans. No, you will not. Soon the great journey shall begin, but when it does, the weight of your heresy will stay your feet, and you shall be left behind. about to fail. There's viscosity throughout the gel layer. Optics totally fried. And let's not even talk about the power supply. You know how expensive this gear is, son? Tell that to the Covenant. Well, I guess it was all obsolete anyway. Your new suit's a Mark VI. Just came up from Songnam this morning. Try and take it easy until you get used to the upgrades. Okay, let's test your targeting first thing. Please look at the top light. Good. Now look at the bottom light. All right, look at the top light again. That's it. Now the bottom one. Okay. Everything checks out. Stand by. I'm going to offline the inhibitors. Move around a little. Get a feel for it. <laughs> 
When you're ready, come meet me by the zapper. Pay attention, because I'm only going over this once. This station will test your recharging energy shields. Your new armor shields are extremely resilient, very efficient. Much better than the Covenant tech we use for the Mark V. Go ahead and use the switch in front of you to start the shield test. Bingo! As you can see, they recharge a lot faster. If your shields go down, find some cover, wait for the meter to read fully charged. That, or you can hide behind me. You done with my boy here, Master Guns? I don't see any training wheels. His armor's working fine, Johnson. You're free to go, son. Just remember, take things slow. Don't worry, I'll hold his hand. So, Johnson, when are you gonna tell me how you made it back home in one piece? Sorry, Guns, it's classified. <laughs> my ass? Well, you can forget about those adjustments to your A2 scope, and you're sure... Well, he's in a particularly fine mood. Maybe Lord Hood didn't give him any indication. Earth. Haven't seen it in years. When I shipped out for basic, the orbital defense grid was all theory and politics. Now look. The Cairo is just one of 300 geosync platforms. That Mac gun can put a round clean through a Covenant capital ship. A coordinated fire from the Athens and the Malta, nothing's getting past this battle cluster in one piece. Ships have been arriving all morning. Nobody's saying much, but I think something big's about to happen. You told me there wouldn't be any cameras. And you told me you were gonna wear something nice. Folks need heroes, Chief, to give them hope. So smile, would you? Well, we still got something to smile about. Sir, near Io. We have probes en route. Uh, I apologize, but we're going to have to make this quick. You look nice. Thank you. Sergeant Major, the Colonial Cross is awarded for acts of singular daring and devotion. For a soldier of the United Earth Space Corps. There can be no greater heresy. Let him be an example for all who would break our covenant. Commander Miranda Keyes, your father's actions were in keeping with the highest traditions of military service. His bravery in the face of impossible odds reflects great credit upon himself and the UNSC. The Navy has lost one of its best.
Flip space ruptures directly off our battle cluster. Show me. Fifteen Covenant Capital ships holding position just outside the kill zone. This is Fleet Admiral Harper. We are engaging the enemy. Negative, Admiral. Form a defensive perimeter around the cluster. Commander, get to your ship. Link up with the fleet. Yes, sir. You have the Mac gun, Cortana. As soon as they come in range, open up. Gladly. Something's not right. The fleet that destroyed Reach was 50 times this size. Sir, additional contacts. Boarding craft and lots of them. They're going to try to take our Mac guns offline. Give their capital ships a straight shot at Earth. Master Chief, defend this station. Yes, sir. I need a weapon. Right this way.
farm. Then they sure as hell brought one here. Chief, find it. Pursuant to Office of Oni Retrieval and Acquisitions Inquiry of 26 September 2552, the following is a target profile of Thel Vatami, Supreme Commander of the Covenant Fleet of Particular Justice compiled by Lieutenant Commander Locke. First confirmed contact with Vatami came in 2535 on an unofficial human colony known as the Rubble. After action reports from civilians, as well as Spartan Units 006, 111, and 120, suggest that Vatami was at that point a relatively minor functionary of the Prophet of Regret. Spartan 006 engaged Vatami in combat on the run. Both parties survived the encounter. Shortly after 2535, the UNSC first encountered the newly formed Covenant Fleet of Particular Justice, now led by Vatami. Review of early engagements with this fleet show that it quickly grew in size from 5 to 60 ships as Vatami cut a path in many human systems. Only Section 3 made multiple attempts to anticipate or even track Vatami's movements at the cost of a number of operators' lives. Vatami eluded all such efforts and he continued his unpredictable and devastating campaign. Vatami also stands out from other Covenant commanders in the frequency in which he takes a personal role in Ground Assaults.
defuse it? Yes, but I'll need the Chief's help to make contact with the detonator. Chief, get to the bomb, double time. Cortana, prioritize targets and fire at will. First echelon, you're with me. Blanket those cruisers. Take them out one by one. Second echelon, keep those carriers busy. Registering all hostile vessels inside the kill zone. I'm in position and ready for immediate assault. Negative, Commander. Not against a ship that size. Not on your own. Sir, permission to leave the station. For what purpose, Master Chief? To give the Covenant back their bomb. Permission granted. I know what you're thinking, and it's crazy. So, stay here. Unfortunately for us both, I like crazy. Just one question. What if you miss? I won't.
good. Chief, get inside. Gear up. We're taking this fight to the surface.